actuator. They are divided into three important types, which is pneumatic, hydraulic and electric actuators. Now, if you look at pneumatic actuators, they are the most used actuators and the best thing about them is they are like flash. They have a very fast response. But the thing is they require utility. You require an air header regulation, actually building the instrument, air, etc. And the maintenance is high to maintain all of these things. And the next option available is electric actuators but they have high current so you have to take care when you have intrinsic safety protection standards and they're kind of sluggish response you could say a fat iron man basically it's difficult to get very high amount of response from them finally you have the juggernaut which is the hydraulic actuators they have very high torque power so whenever there's a requirement of high torque you can see the hulk of the application for example very large sizes line for example you can see here one example interested to learn control valves in depth then there is a free ebook available which covers amazing parameters like material selection valve sizing valve design and valve standards the link is given in the description below please subscribe if you have liked the video